Welcome back to the channel, you guys. Today we are gonna be talking about a newer brand that, well, I don't know, it's newer to me, but a brand that has been more recently been getting a lot of uptick and more popularity um, that I've been seeing uh, on social media and magazines. And the brand that I am talking about, if you've not guessed already, because we love luxury brands here at this channel, is Autour. Autour is a German-made skincare brand that uses highly active ingredients to improve the skin. And they are a more natural-based, high-active ingredient company. So you're getting high-active ingredients and you're getting something that is more naturally derived, whether you're into that or not is all up to you, but I do believe in the function of science and, you know, more earth-made things. I, I think everything has a symbiotic relationship, so I do like when science and that nature meet together, um, and those are some great products that I love to use. So, Altor, thank you so much for sending me this product, along with um, some of the other ones that I will be putting out videos soon. Uh, I've really been enjoying this cleanser. Now, the product I'm gonna be talking about today, you guys, and can we just take a second to admire this packaging? Gorgeous, stunning. I love the packaging. The packaging looks great on your vanity, on your countertop, in your shower. It looks good anywhere. Now, this is some luxury packaging if I've ever seen it. Now, this product that I'm gonna be talking about today is the Definitive Enzyme Cleanser. Now, the Definitive Enzyme Cleanser is gonna be exactly what the name states. It's an enzyme cleanser. It is going to exfoliate the skin. Um, it, this product in particular uses alpha hydroxy acids to gently exfoliate the very surface layer of your skin to help reveal a smoother, brighter, more even-toned complexion. Now, if you've never used a powder cleanser before, some of them can get a little gritty, they cannot dissolve properly, and they can be a little aggravating to the skin because of the texture, because of how it's refined. You guys, this cleanser does not disappoint. I was a little nervous about it, I was a little apprehensive, because my skin doesn't do very well with leave-on types of exfoliating products. So. I'm not typically using a lot of exfoliators because my skin just becomes very sensitized. Now, I can do a lot to my skin with injections, mesotherapy, threads, chemical peels. My skin does great for all that. I have no sensitivity to try, no one. But if I use any type of leave-on exfoliating product in conjunction with the other things that I do, my skin just can't handle it. And rule of thumb, always listen to your skin. If your skin is feeling sensitized, Step back, take a break, take a breath, switch your products to something gentle till your skin barrier is repaired. Now this product I had specifically asked about, since it is an AHA product and it is exfoliating, will my skin become sensitized? Their response was that this product particularly has a special molecule, an amino acid, that helps to prevent irritation, therefore making it suitable for just about anybody. All you would really base it on is how your skin is feeling and if you're experiencing sensitivity. So it just really depends on how frequently you're using it. And spoiler alert, I've been using it every day with zero irritation. What? Zero irritation. And it must be because of that special molecule. So let's go ahead and show you what it's like before we delve into some ingredients. Now, as I mentioned, this is a powdered cleanser and you don't have to use a whole lot of the product. This is about the amount that I use every day. And I will typically use this when I'm in the shower, so I'll usually just get a couple drops of water. For this, I'm gonna use a little tiny bit of ramekin of water. But you don't need a lot of water, you just need a tiny bit. Now I have already washed and cleansed my face this morning, so I'm not gonna be doing it again. But, 
as you can see, it does lather. So if I want to make it a little bit more of a paste, I can. But picture putting this on a wet face. This is going to lather more. Now it's not like a lather like using a gel cleanser, but it is a light lather that is actually enjoyable and I thought I would miss having that lather. But as you can see, it is creamy. It does get lathery. And you guys, the smell of this product is amazing. I don't know what it is that smells in here so good, but it almost reminds me of uh, Orbe. Like, obviously that's not a comparison because that's hair product. But the aroma reminds me of Orbe shampoos and conditioners if you've ever smelled those. Now, I have been enjoying, like I said, this cleanser. It has been really great to my skin. It doesn't dry my skin out. It doesn't strip the natural barrier or disturb it. Uh, my skin has been more vibrant. It's had more of a glow. It's been more radiant. Um, it's actually done extremely well. Now, this isn't something that I would use twice a day, um, just because I know my skin. Um, and if you're someone that does have sensitive skin, you actually can use this, but you would want to use it one day, wait a few days, and use it again. You may only need to use it a couple times a week. But if you're someone with regular skin, normal skin, uh, you could get away with using this as your daily cleanser. Whether it's morning, whether it's night, that's all on you and your skincare routine. But I've been using it every single morning with zero issues, zero concern, and it has been wonderful. Now, I am going to be looking on their website because I don't want to give you any misinformation, but this contains so many good ingredients that are for the skin. Now, like I had mentioned before, this does contain an alpha hydroxy acid. Um, this also contains vitamin C. It contains a bunch of skin brightening ingredients like, ascor like well, ascorbic acid, ascorbyl glucoside. I have zero clue what that is, but it works alongside the vitamin C, um, which will help lighten and prevent age spots, hyperpigmentation. Um, so your skin, being out in the sun, will have less opportunity to become discolored or to develop hyperpigmentation or melasma. So that's really cool. Uh, it contains niacinamide, um, which is a derivative of vitamin B3, which is going to help prevent pigmentation um, and the future formation of pigmentation problems. It helps to strengthen and protect the skin's lipid barrier. It helps to refine uh, your skin and your pores for a cleaner, smoother, complexion. Um, it contains an ingredient called ectoin or ectoin, which is a natural stress protecting amino acid molecule, which is what the company had told me, um, that is going to help support the skin's natural defense um, from environmental damage uh, like UVA and UVB. And it helps to prevent inflammation for a healthier complexion and a more resilient, stronger skin. And those are just some of the key, those are just some of the key ingredients that are in here. Um, there's also a citric acid. And then there's a product called Zymolift MD. I am not sure what that is, but if there's any questions about it, you can absolutely head over to worldofalltourskincare.com to find out more about the ingredients. I'm not an ingredient expert. I'm just here to tell you I love this cleanser. Now, we know that I love the Augustina Spotter. We know that I love my La Mer. We know that Augustina Spotter has basically taken over my vanity, my medicine cabinet, my life. Um, and still to this day, even at the start of this channel, Augustina Spotter is still my main skincare routine. I swap out my cleansers periodically, um, but at the end of the day, my main skincare is my rich cream and it really tackles everything for me um but you know i love trying luxury products you know we love to swap out you guys we get bored we all get bored so it is nice to get different products and try them out and this product has really really amazed me 
And I do, I hate to say it, but the definitive, definitive Enzyme Cleanser is probably going to become a staple in my skincare routine uh, because it is great to exfoliate your skin. And this is a rinse off product, so it's not going to stick around and, you know, continue exfoliating. So it's not a leave on product. Um, so my skin can handle that. And now I actually have a way to do a more regular exfoliation of my skin like I wasn't been, a been able to do before. Now this cleanser does retail, I believe, at $170. Yes, it's $170 US dollars. And you are getting... 1.76 ounces of powder and this I have been using this now for at least a couple of months and I still have half of a bottle now there is a six month shelf life on here so if you are someone that is using it daily you will probably go through this in maybe a little bit less than six months if you're someone that's only using this once twice maybe three times a week you will probably honestly go past six months so just because the shelf life is at six months we know that most things you know still can be stable and being that this is a powder i would say that this will be safe to use you know at least a couple months or so past its shelf life um of six months but don't take my word for it i'm not here to recommend any medical device or make any claims that's just what i would do um, if you haven't heard of Altor, definitely a brand worth checking out. Um, if you've used this cleanser or used any of the other products, definitely leave a comment in the descriptions below because I'd be very curious to know what your experience is using the Altor skincare. Um, one product that has been in my eyesight is the Composition Number no. 1 Serum. Altor, if you're listening or you're watching this, I would love to try that. So, shameless, um shameless request um, for product review. Um, so Altor, hit me up if you want me to try and review that product. I would love it, love it, love it. And if you've tried the Composition Number no. 1 Serum, uh, let me know what your thoughts on it are because I'm very, very intrigued. Um, but yeah, that's all I got for you today. I just really wanted to jump on to introduce to you the Altor skincare line and most importantly, the Definitive Enzyme Cleanser, which is the first start of my skincare routine that has been taking place on my other cleansers every morning. And that's all I got for you guys. Um, leave some comments in the descriptions below. Let me know your thoughts. Have you tried this product line? Have you tried this product in particular? Let me know. I'd love to connect. Um, that's all I got. So until next time, you guys, stay healthy, be well, and most importantly, be kind. Bye.